What's up? I am back. In this video, I'm going to show you in how to use the hyperlink control in JavaFX. The hyperlink control in JavaFX is simply a button styled to look like a hyperlink in a web page. The hyperlink in a web page is used to navigate to another web page. However, the hyperlink in JavaFX is different. You are free to perform any action in the action event handler. So in this tutorial, I'm going to show you in how to open a URL using the hyperlink and display the web page in our web view. And another example, we are going to open a URL and display the web page in our default browser. And let's get started. Open your IDE and let's create a new JavaFX project, this one. And we will use the scene builder to uh, make the application. And I'm going to drag a B box here and add some label and hyperlink. And also the web view. Web view. All right, and let's resize the web view and go to VBox and go to properties and let's set the alignment to center and let's rename the label here. Let's say understanding uh, hyperlink hyperlink in JavaFX and let's resize the font size like this one underst understanding understanding okay understanding hyperlink in JavaFX and I think that's it and let's resize the hyperlink to 820 and that's it for now let's go to hyperlink and let's uncheck the focus traversable and go to code right here and let's set the ID to hyperlink and on the action event hyperlink again and our web view let's uh, make it bigger okay the web view how about make it bigger again make it more bigger all right and That's it, and let's go here at the web view and set the FX ID to web view and save our FXML. Let's go back to our IDE and let's code. So I'm going to uh, create a VBox and root equals FXML loader import the fxml loader load get class get resource string make sure you enter the fxml file here so here fx hyperlink that fxml and let's import the vvox and let's create the scene and pass in the variable root and import the scene and let's change the primary states to stage 
stage that set scene scene and stage that set title to understanding hyperlink and stage the show so let's go to our controller and right click to our hyperlink fxml and make controller all right we have the action event the variables and let's go to the action event and let's open a url for example open google.com let's say with web view that get engine and load load the url something like https google.com right, comment this using opening a url to our web view So let's try to run our application to see what that looks like. Okay. And if I'm going to click the hyperlink, the URL will be displayed to our web view. All right. So as you can see, the hyperlink is underlined and go in black this means that the hyperlink is visited All right that's it and let's go to the next example let's comment this code right here and open the URL in our default browser let's let's create a desktop desktop equals desktop Let's import the desktop. Let get desktop. Desktop. That browse, and let's put the URI. So to put the URI, we're going to use the Java.net URI, and let's type the Java.net URI. And let's parse the URI to string. I mean, let's parse the string to URI. So, HTTP and Google.com. I think we have an error. Yep, throws clause for IO exception. If you want to learn more with desktop class, you can visit the link at the upper right corner right now. And let's run this application. See what that looks like. Okay. And if I'm going to click the hyperlink, the URL will be displayed. And that's it and I hope you learned something new in this tutorial please don't forget to like subscribe comment and share and I will see you in the next video